I better call the doctor, cause I've got spring fever! Good morning, little flowers. Good morning, Squidward. Isn't it a lovely day? Huh. Uh, did you say hello to the flowers yet? Good morning, flowers. Gosh, I didn't know Squidward had hay fever. I'll do him a kindness and plant some hypoallergenic flowers. You're on your way. I bet you're thirsty. I'm not taking my eyes off you. everybody likes you. Three days later. I love you. Hey, SpongeBob. Hi, Patrick. How does this keep happening? Hi. She's beautiful. Wow. What a magnificent seahorse. I shall tame her. Who knows what we can accomplish? Because of her mysterious behavior, I have decided to name her Mystery. Hmm. Now that I think about it, she's also very graceful and majestic. Perhaps I should name her Grace, or Majesty, or Debbie. She must have spotted my floral bookmark. She's coming this way. That's it, girl. Don't be afraid. I'm just a talking sponge is all. Do you think we'll be friends forever? I'll take that as a yes. What the? Hey, Squidward! Still riding to work on a machine, I see. Don't say anything, Squidward. Remember your karma. What? here until I'm done with work. See you at the end of my shift. Hey, look! Mr. Krabs put in a kitty ride! Why don't you try it out? I can't find the coin slot! Here it is! Oh, a monster! Scared away me customers! That's not a monster, Mr. Krabs. It's a horse. She's my friend. Her name is Mystery. You're a mystery, SpongeBob. Get rid of it. Please, Mr. Krabs, let her stay. She won't hurt nobody no how. It's either you or Mystery. I knew I should have named her Debbie. SpongeBob! Thanks for finally getting rid of that horse! You're welcome, Mr. Krabs. Now if we could just get rid of Squidward. Good one, sir. Ha! It worked, girl! I'll just keep you back here until Patrick finishes that stable I asked him to build. Of course.
course I want you around. Like Only eight more hours. <laughs> Twelve <laughs> seconds later. Oh, no, Mystery, you can't come out yet. If Old Man Crab sees you, I'll lose my job. Wait a sec. I bet you're hungry. How about some lunch? Shh, girl, you gotta be quiet, or... SpongeBob, what was that? Is that horse in here? No, Mr. Krabs. I was just doing my imitation of Mystery. We saw... Well, keep working on it. That was terrible. That was close. From now on, no more hijinks. Put her up! Huh? SpongeBob, where's my order? Did you look under the tray? Oh, no, I didn't. Sorry. I... SpongeBob, could you just get my order? They vanished. Squidward, do you think the Krusty Krab is... Haunted? What if they come for me next? I gotta get out of here! SpongeBob, there's no ghosts! Of course I want oh. you around. Let's In case you've forgotten, here's how things work. I order the food, you cook the food, then the customer gets the food. We do that for 40 years, and then we die. Sounds like a pretty good deal to me. What do you say? Yeah, yeah, I hear you, Squidward. I'll be right back. What's that? Don't tell Mr. Krabs! I've got it all under control. Now then, you were saying? Just get my order. You got it, Squidward. Ah, ghosts. <laughs> Mystery, you ate my hat. <gasps> Mystery, you ate my spatula. You ate all the Krabby Patties. You ate the stove. You ate old man Jenkins. I don't want to be a burden. <laughs> Folks, we have a minor situation going on in the kitchen. Where's our food? I'm so hungry. This is my only lunch hour. Where's old man Jenkins? Take it easy. The food's no good here anyway. Squidward, what's going on in here? Why don't you go ask Cow Bob Ranch Pants and his faithful companion, Sir Eats A Lot? SpongeBob, what's the meaning of all these nicknames? David H. Jones! Mystery got a bellyache from eating Krabby Patties, so I made her a bicarbonate of soda. <laughs> what did I miss? Of course I want you around. Let's see me. I love you. So, my eyes are correct. You still have that horse after I ordered you to get rid of it. Well, now I'm going to get rid of it once and for all. No, Mr. Krabs! Please don't make me give up Mystery! I know you think she's just a horse, but she's more than that, I tell you. She listens to me. She understands everything I say, and I understand her. She's my best friend. Oh, was it? <laughs> hey, who left this bowl of onions here? SpongeBob, your story has touched me heart. Believe it or not, I know what it's like to give up a best friend. You do? I was five years old, and my father gave me a dollar. I love that dollar. Loved it like a brother. Me and that dollar went everywhere together. What happened to the dollar, Mr. Krabs? And one day, at the beach, it was so hot, and I was so thirsty, I spent it on a soda. <laughs> My best friend. <laughs> What? What'd you get out of here? The point is, son, sometimes you have to set things free even though it's hard. Look at her. She misses the great outdoors, the wide open spaces, the rolling green pastures. The kitchen is no place for a live horse. Huh? <laughs> All right, Mr. Krabs. I understand. <laughs> Hey! Okay, girl. You're free to go. I can't keep you anymore. <laughs> I know it's hard for you to understand, but Mr. Krabs is right. You belong in the wild. Well, what are you waiting for? Can't you see I don't watch anymore? <laughs> Just get out of here, you stupid dumb animal!
<laughs> well, she's gone, and I'll never see her again. It's okay, son. You did the proper thing. She's free now, and we have no right to separate that wild animal from its natural habitat. Hey, Mr. Krabs, looks like old Mystery had an after-dinner salad. Get that horse! Uh, mystery! mystery! Come back! Mystery! Uh, Lisa! Mystery! mystery! Come back here! I want you around you.